Divine Nails. If you are new, hi, my name is Destiny. I am the proud owner of Divine Nails. I started it out with Press On Nails and branched out to retail, including cosmetics, which um, started with my magnetic lashes. Yeah. So today's video is going to be about how to apply my particular five pair and three pair lashes. They work the same, just different amounts and different and uh, smaller um, tools. If that makes sense. Uh, you'll understand in a minute. Okay, so a little bit about magnetic lashes before we um, continue on. I feel like uh, magnetic liner is a lot more safer than glue because the glue can get in your eye and cause you like infections or skin irritations and can also rip out your natural lashes while magnetic lashes they don't rip out your la natural lashes and they don't like drip into your eye like yeah using any product around your eye could be potentially dangerous especially if you poke yourself in the eye but if you are patient you won't if you follow my tutorial you won't <laughs> um and yeah so i guess we're gonna jump right into it now what you will need is your lashes so five pair three pair or even individual pair um, whatever lashes you are using you'll need those a lash tool to brush out your lashes when you're done and regular eyeliner you probably need a mirror um, you will need a mirror and mascara is optional. Um, I don't really like mascara. That's the whole point of why I got magnetic lashes anyways. Um, but I will be using it in this video because I have noticed that, you know, it does help. Um, but you don't need mascara with it. You can just put on the liner and go. Okay, so you're going to want to start with a clean face. Um, if you're doing just, you know, just the lashes and you don't want to really do anything else. Um, like I'm doing but if you've done your makeup um, it's loud outside so if you're done your makeup um, you know then follow these steps after you're done your eyes and things like that so we're gonna get started um, so I'm just gonna like lean in for you guys and show you guys um, how to do this since I don't have proper equipment right now. So this is optional, it is, um, but it's basically your outline and this video is mostly for beginners. So um, if you're just starting out, you'd want a regular liner first because magnetic liner, you have to scrub off with makeup wipes, okay? And you probably don't want to do that, don't want the hassle of it. So I just suggest using a regular liner first. So if you make a mess, you'd be able to do it. So you want to keep your eyes open and possibly like tilting it a bit, but then you want to like start from maybe the middle, wherever you're comfortable and just, whoops. Yeah, that happens sometimes. Okay. So you want to start from the middle and just gently Take it. So you want some patience as well if you're just starting out. So make sure you have patience to learn this. There we go. And just take it. This liner is also running out, so you just outline. Above your Natural lash line. There we go. You 
you can close it a little bit if you want but you definitely want to like have it open for the most part especially when you're doing this outer part because if you're closing your eye you'll wrinkle like that you know and you have to have you know one eye open so but yeah you're just gonna want to open for the most part and close it just a little bit for like the inner part but other than that you'll want it open so there's a regular liner I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye okay so now that both eyes are done I'm going to take my magnetic liner so the magnetic liner for the three pair looks like this it's fairly small and the magnetic liner for the five pair looks like this a lot lot um a lot more in here obviously because there's five more pairs but I'm using the smaller one just because it's easier to grip and whatnot so I definitely recommend three pair for beginners but if you want the five pair that's fine too um, just because it's smaller so you know you can just have it here the wand for the five pair is fairly long but it's easier to just have it like this so you're gonna take your magnetic liner and you're gonna give it um, like a little bit of a shake just to shake it up you'll want to do that at, before each use because um, you know you don't want anything sticking to the sides or drying up or anything like that so you want to shake it often okay so then you're gonna go in and start with the corner Sorry about that. You're gonna go in, starting with the corner, keeping your eyes open, and you're gonna just start by slowly applying it. It's fine if you get it on um, a little bit of your lashes. That's where you can take the lash brush before it dries and just you know, go like that and wipe it off with the lash brush. Just gently, because you're most likely probably, like if you get it on um, your lashes at all, you're most likely gonna just get it on the tip. So you just wanna be careful though when you wipe it. There you go. And then you'll go in with your second coat. There you go. So you're gonna want that to dry. So if you just got done your makeup, maybe you haven't done your lips yet, or you wanna do your brows, or you wanna do other parts or whatever, then you can do that while you're waiting for it to dry. I feel like it just, you know, passes time. Um, if you don't have anything to do, then I don't know, check your phone or something, or just wait and you can just dry it like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye. Okay, so we're gonna wait for that to dry. As you noticed, I have done a little bit of a mess. Um, if you have a makeup brush, um, you can, you know, just clean it up before it dries. Like, just go like that a little bit. And just, you know, kinda clean it up. Now, it doesn't have to be so thick. You can put it on really light. I wanted it thicker that way you can actually see it again this is for beginners so you can have it thick you can have it light um, whatever but yeah this eye is pretty much dry so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take 
our lash tool and we're gonna take um, the lashes I really like full lashes so this is the five pair but we're gonna take the fuller lashes here so like I said I only wanted to use the little eyeliner from the three pair but we are using five pair lashes so you're gonna take your mirror and then you're gonna want to place the corner right at the edge of your natural lashes like where they are and you're gonna want to hold it up because it'll be more dramatic like so instead of having it like this and it's not as dramatic so it's up to you but if you want more dramatic or you want it to look a lot better then we're gonna hold it up as we place it on okay so that oh I don't think you guys saw sorry so that is without mascara I just noticed I don't I didn't put mascara on it's a habit because I don't usually have mascara on you're just gonna pinch it you can pinch your natural lashes with your falsies just gentle don't pinch your skin because that hurts and just pinch them shut just lightly you don't have to be aggressive and then you can even use the end of your lash tool and like press it up against the lining and then you can take your lash tool and, or your lash brush and just brush it out if needed And there you go so I'm gonna do the other eye with mascara so a trick for putting mascara on so you don't get it up here is to have your mirror below and just like look down while putting your mascara on because then you don't get any mess up here so I'm just put it on So just whether you apply mascara or don't apply, the only reason why um, like why you would want to apply mascara with your falsies is most likely because you want them to blend in more. So even after the mascara, you're going to go in and grab your other lash with the lash tool. And on your other eye, we're going to do the same thing with the corner out there, holding it up, okay? There we go. See how gorgeous that looks? Mascara definitely makes it look more bolder. So we're just gonna go in and pinch them shut, pinch them together. all right then we're just gonna brush them out alrighty so that is how you apply your lashes okay so um, I'm also going to show you how to remove them as well so an easy way to remove them is with your sorry about that I have a dog so um, you either with your fingers or with your lash tool you would pull on the outer side and just take off your lash okay so the next thing that you can do is have a q-tip and some oil and just rub it off 
like just gently roll the q-tip off and um, that's an easy way to remove it you can use baby oil olive oil canola oil whatever oil um, and you can also use micular water if you use that um, and whatnot just because it's not gonna come off like regular makeup really like with a bunch of makeup wipes it takes a lot of scrubbing but the oil method is definitely an easier way so yeah okay thank you so much for watching you guys i hope you enjoyed this video on how to apply your magnetic lashes if you're interested in my lashes my shop link is down in the description um in the description box below um and yeah my blog is also there you can check out my new website with the blog and anything else that you might find interesting my facebook all of my links my social media everything is in the description box below thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i'll leave you to that bye